You know, I, I think um, I think there's some guys that have honestly played football maybe better than what we thought their skill set may be. Um, but again, I think that's still fluid until 15 practices and getting in fall, letting them get adjusted. But I think there's some guys that are capable. You know, guys like Bobby Leith have, have shown that they've got some potential to play. For us. Gabe Luna has done some nice things. Justin Thomas maybe been dinged up, injured at times last year, and, and maybe back full strength here. Aka, you know, uh, there's another name, but there's some guys that, that have the capability and potential. I think we feel good about the potential of what that group brings to the table. But again, you know, what's their, what's their buy-in value? How, what's their ability to play consistently day in and day out? And then can they do and understand schematically what we're going to get accomplished? So, well, I, I just love the flexibility because even though we may be based in the 4-2-5, I think if you we can line up in the 3-4, we can line up in you know, we can do, we can have two defense alignment times. It gives us flexibility and it gives us the ability to use our, can you hear me say this on offense, our best players and put them in position to be successful. And I think ultimately that's our job is find out what these guys can do, team practices, then sit back, reevaluate, and then do a great job in the meantime, then as we get into fall camp of putting them in position to be successful. Well, you know, I think our, you know, my my belief in this is always trying to where, where can we get the most value, the most bang for our buck, and you know, I, I think obviously being able to to link up with Michigan down there, um, you know, I think maybe gives us the most value rather than just Iowa State going down there, and and so, you know, obviously this is such a touch touchy subject and it's fluid until the NCA goes to vote on all all these issues, but I think the reality is it's great for kids, and you know, it'd be a shame Shame if, if this goes away, we're really devaluing young people and to, to get recruited. So, you know, I think we're going to continue to find unique ways for us to get to certain areas that maybe are outside our own radius and how can we get the most value for us in our football program.